Dowry. Dower in victory first up and Snow and May, the race favourite, moving up. And Lazura now is the last to go forward. So Lazura completes the lineup. Six fillies running in this year's Dali Flight Stakes. And Lazura moving in now to the outside draw. So the light is on. We're ready to go. Snow and May is the Flight Stakes favourite. And they're ready to jump. Racing now. Lazura flopped out of the gates last. Snow in May was second last out. And Lady Shenandoah jumped all right with Miss Bustlinger. And Powers of Opal is pushing through on the inside. Might lead all of them here. Then Harlem Queen, three for the back to Snow in May. And Lazura, who flopped out of the gates last, settles in that position. So Powers of Opal has been very strong as a backmarker in lead-up races. Makes the running here in a race void of any speed. So Powers of Opal leads by two on Miss Bustlinger. Harlem Queen third the fence. Lady Shenandoah took a sit and gets some nice cover at this point. Snow in May, the favourite, two lengths behind her and a length off to Lazua. So it's the maiden of the field, Powers of Opal in front. Leads by two lengths to Miss Bustlinger. Harlem Queen well positioned third, a half the outside, Lady Shenandoah. A length and a half then to Snow in May and Lazua sees them all. So the six fillies race towards the home corner and the group one flight stake. 600 metres to go. Powers of Opal in front by a length to Miss Bustlinger, then Harlem Queen, Lady Shenandoah next, two for the back to Snow in May, and Lazura's back last of all, coming around the turn, Powers of Opal going boldly in the lead, Miss Bustlinger under pressure, Lady Shenandoah gets going very swiftly on the outside, and here comes the Lady, Lady Shenandoah put paid to Powers of Opal and Snow Queen two lengths away, 200 metres to go, Lady Shenandoah's full of running, she's strong, she's robust, and Lady Shenandoah's home and hosed here the flight stakes. Harlem Queen bursting home late, but Lady Shenandoah trounces them. Harlem Queen second, Snow in May third, Powers of Opal fourth, then Lazura and Miss Bustling of his last in. Ah, nice filly, Lady Shenandoah. Just coming to herself now over the right trip of a mile, and off that she'll get even further. Lady Shenandoah, different class there on the flight stakes. Zach Lloyd with a Group 1 success here today, teaming up with Chris Waller, raced by Hermitage, and uh, with Autumn Glow going amiss yesterday, they had uh, things pretty well covered there with Lady Shenandoah. She's a filly by Snitzel at a star pupil. I think she won one race at Tamworth, uh, the mayor. This is a very good type, Lady Shenandoah, going back-to-back, -back, winning the Ming Dynasty first up and blowing them away here on the flight stakes today. Nathan Dirls, um, Nathan was looking for his first Group 1 winner today. His fillies run enormous there, Harlem Queen going home into second, getting home a lot better than the favourite at the end, Snow in May finishing third and a gap back to Powers of Opal. No speed today so they tried something different by leading with her and at the end was just outclassed. Uh, interim placings are up now, 4729 4729 the time is 134.83 3433 the last 600 metres, that was a big win to Lady Shenandoah in the Dali Flight Stakes. Finally get something right today. <laughs> yeah, I like, really liked her. Yes, yeah, nice filly. <laughs>